In this project, we'll show you how to make a glowing stool using NeoPixel LEDs and 3D printing. The NeoPixel LEDs are Bluetooth connected, so you can change the colors and animations with the Adafruit Bluefruit LE app for smartphones. The 3D printed seat can hold up to 200 pounds of weight, so it's safe to sit on, and you can use it indoors or out. The electronics are mounted to the bottom of the seat, and they appear hidden when viewed from above. Wooden dowels act as the legs and feature rubber feet that are 3D printed in NinjaFlex. This provides proper grip so they won't slip on surfaces or dig into the ground. A high capacity battery makes it fully portable and it's also rechargeable. The design files are free to download so you can 3D print them yourself or send them to a 3D printing service like 3D Hubs. You'll only need a few electronic components to build this project, all of which you can find in the links below. The seat takes about 24 hours to 3D print and it requires a large build volume. We 3D printed this on a Type A Machines Series 1 Pro with a 30% infill and translucent PLA filament. To start this build, we'll need to solder together four quarter sized NeoPixel sections to make the 60 NeoPixel ring. You can follow along with our step by step tutorial linked in the description. We'll need to apply a decent amount of solder to join the three pads together. Then we can connect the wires to ground, power, and data in. The wires can be routed through the holes in the seat. A 3D printed cover will protect the NeoPixel PCBs from any moisture or potential forces. To connect the wires to the board, we'll strip away some insulation and tin them with a bit of solder. The data in wire from the NeoPixel ring will connect to pin number 6 on the Adafruit Feather. We secured the Adafruit feather to standoffs that are on the bottom of the seat using M25 machine screws. A slide switch will allow us to turn the circuit on and off. This can be wired to the enable and ground pins on the Adafruit feather. A 2000 milliamp hour battery will connect to the onboard JST and it can be tucked inside one of the holes on the seat. The Adafruit Bluefruit LE app connects to the featherboard and it works with both iOS and Android devices. You can use the color picker to choose different colors or the controller pad to trigger animations. The Arduino sketch can be found in the tutorial linked below. For the wooden dowels, we 3D printed these rubber feet in NinjaFlex. The bottom of the seat features these couplers for the dowels to be inserted into. A triangular frame adds stability to the legs and it will keep them in place. And that's pretty much it for the assembly. This project can be easily connected to the internet using a Wi-Fi connected board. For example, you could have the LED animations match the weather or they can change when you get a notification. We want to hear what ideas you have for this project, so you can let us know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe for more projects from Adafruit.